walking I wanted to get a run in this morning, but we also need breakfast. So I'm running to Starbucks to get a nice breakfast. Lucy's still at home this morning, guys. She wants an iced coffee, so I'm going to get her one now. It's a gorgeous day here today, guys. Welcome to the vlog. One of those mornings, guys, where you just feel grateful for everything. The weather lifts your mood. Everyone's out early morning, everyone's happy. Today's the day of the London Marathon. A British record as he crosses the line. Which didn't particularly inspire this run, because it's only about 10 minutes long. But if you, if you did the London Marathon, amazing. Lucy and I have had a really good week. The event vlog went live, so that's the previous video on the channel. If you haven't seen it, go check it out. But thanks for all the comments, all the support on that vlog. You guys loved seeing all the behind the scenes and stuff from that. Today's a nice day. We're gonna head out into Brighton. I think we're gonna try and buy some more summery clothes. My wardrobe's full of jumpers. It's just not right for this weather. If it's gonna stay like this, we need some summer clothes. We'll also update you on the teeth whitening, how that's going. We've been using the uh, teeth serum for the last couple of days. And I think we might go and look at our new lens for this guy. I don't know if this is the smartest idea, but I'll put our drinks in a bag. Ice latte and a cinnamon swirl. Nearly ready to leave the house, guys. We're gonna visit my grandparents first this morning and then we're gonna head off into Brighton. I wanted to quickly show you guys this. This is Slick Gorilla. I saw this on an Instagram ad and I bought it myself. They haven't sent me this to talk about or anything like that. I literally went on Amazon Prime and bought this. It was like 9.99. It's like a powder rather than a gel because I hate when you put loads of stuff in your hair and it gets really stiff. So I'm gonna give this a go. I thought I'd show you guys how it works if I like it. Um, but it's not an ad or anything like that. Literally bought it myself because I thought it looked cool. I, I have no idea how much to use at all. I'm just gonna use like that for now. And do I, I think you put it in your hair first, but I've put it on my hand here. Uh, so I'll put it, rub it in my hands. Why would you rub it in? It's powder. Okay, put it on my hair, yeah? Don't chuck it either because it'll go everywhere. Okay. What are you doing? Just gonna sprinkle it into my hair. <clears throat> okay, it's in the hair now, so. Let me just go for it, I think. Maybe I need a bit more. I just, I just shake it into the top of your head and just... Oh, yeah, good idea. Actually, it's pretty, actually, that's really good. Will it hold, though, for the day? Okay, let's put a tiny bit more in on my head. Yeah, okay. I don't really know if it's done anything. Looks all right. Doesn't, oh, yeah, it feels like there's a bit of texture in there, to be fair. Hands aren't sticky. Hair's not sticky. Still move it around. Okay, I think that might be right. We're nearly in Brighton now, guys, and oh, we've really? just been having a chat. Yeah, it's busy today on the so roads. Busy. So the busy. The sun's so out. There's traffic everywhere. Why is everyone driving in the sun? I know. What are I they know doing? We are, but... What are they doing? We've just been having a chat about dreams. I had a really weird dream last night that Lucy and I got married, and you might be saying that's not weird. You've been together four years. Is it not on the cards anyway? And People always say to me, "Oh, you're getting married soon." I'm like, "I'm 21." Yeah, and I'm 20. Like, I'm 20 plus a few, I'm 24. But we got married in this dream and I didn't feel right after it, not because of Lucy, it wasn't anything to do with that. I just felt like, that's done now, now what? Yeah. yeah. I felt so young in this dream, so it's, like, made, it's made me realize so there's no there's no wedding anytime soon, guys. We've got friends who are married, haven't we? Yeah, that's like? fine. Like, some people we know our age are like, married, which is great, it's perfect for them. But I don't know, it's, like. There's no right or wrong time to do no. it. If, if it's right for you, great if it's not great oh, we will get married one day i'm sure but like it's not people it's like all oh, like every holiday we go on like oh is he gonna pop the question and i'm like no definitely not and they're like oh but he might be and i'm like no he's definitely not gonna because we, <laughs> we don't want to like i don't not yet i said no i don't it doesn't to mean i mean like it's obviously lovely getting married and stuff and it will be lovely one day but for me obviously the day is lovely like having family there and like making an occasion but it doesn't make any difference to me having like ring my finger and being like officially married. Plus, I quite like my surname and I don't really want to put <laughs> up. And we're in our 20s. Yeah, so we've been together a long time. I mean, I'm 21 and we've been together four and a half years. So like, I suppose four and a half years is normally like, I don't know, about the right time maybe, like as an, as an average. But if like maybe we'd bet and I was 25, 30, fine, yeah, probably. 
but 21, like, chill out, guys. I'm, I'm not ready to get married yet. I'm still a kid. <laughs> chicken rice bowl insane our plans ruined guys ruined by this weather with a short sleeve shirt i'm freezing now we thought it was going to be warm we were going to walk down the beach we were going to get some sun top up the tan i hold that now but no but no so we're going to go and take some photos for lucy's instagram now wow look it's actually misty we're going to take it's freezing the weather has literally changed since we went in for lunch we're going to go and take some photos for lucy's instagram now and then we're going to get home show you what we bought and go through that just got back to pay for the parking and you know the little mini wins in life there's a price for up to two hours and there's a price for three to four hours we were here for one hour and 59 minutes which meant we were in the two hour bit literally by one minute 13.44 and then hour at 15.43 how good's that back now from brighton guys we had a great time however the weather did let us down slightly but we're not gonna let that affect our mood on this it's channel bad. we're gonna show you exactly what we got from primark we're gonna try it on there were so many people in primark it was super busy we couldn't Horrible, actually film actually. in the shop it's cold it's like 10 degrees, it was like 30 the other day. Freeze, like, and we were doing the Instagrams in Hove and, and it was cold. Like I was wearing like freezing. summery clothes for the pictures because I bought loads of summery clothes recently um, for summer apparently. And yeah, absolutely freezing. I was like running into the car to get changed. It was horrible. Like, why are you laughing so much? I don't that was know. Funny. I don't know. I've just had like, I've just downed an espresso because when we got That's in, I felt so, so tired. I've literally downed an, a strong espresso. Pretty much double actually. <laughs> <laughs> no, it's not. It's one pod. No, but I filled but it up. Added to the more top. water to it. it so it's not a double. It's just a weak espresso. Right, we need to get over this. Lucy's got some spaghetti on the go <laughs> because we've got a new oven, guys. Well, I haven't got this spaghetti is, on because the... I've got a new oven. <laughs> <laughs> new oven, me. This is the spaghetti. This is um, basically our oven door fell off. Right? <laughs> yes, it did. No, because literally, no, I just want to tell the story. I had, I had food in the oven like on full heat, like boiling, just about to take it out. I'm the, like the, the handle fell off ages ago. Oh yeah, the handle's so been like, long gone. Putting my hands around the side of the oven to pull it down with these big gloves on, <laughs> and I literally pull it off. The door comes off in my hand, <laughs> and the glass, the glass is still there. And Can't it's, get like, the food so out. Hot. Can't get the food <laughs> out of the oven. <laughs> this much on the video right we need to show you this primark that's why you clicked on the video we do apologize for our immaturity let's get going so under my pillow <laughs> <laughs> what why is it all under my pillow i don't know how to shut <laughs> let, let me show them what i'm looking at what I'm just, what are you doing i'm just relaxing this is a top um from primark it's all primark this was eight pounds and it's like a tie up thing. Um, I like that, <laughs> summary. Lost the world to live. Some vibes. Yeah, it's nice. Shall I try it on? Yeah. <laughs> Do you like it? I like this. Um, I've also got these jeans and I put them on because I don't want to be in my knickers. It's just like blue jeans. I'll probably like roll them up here uh, with trainers or whatever. Nice and tight. Took me about an hour to get them on. If I wear a bra or not with it, probably, maybe not. I don't know. Do you think? Well, you'd have to be careful, wouldn't you? Yeah. For any. Popping. Cool, yeah, definitely wearing one. Sorry to interrupt the haul, but how has this happened? Oh, oh, oh. I guess it just sprawled everywhere. No I forgot way. to shove it all in. By the way, guys, new oven. What do you think? Yes. Modern. There's like a cheese string. You know the guy in the cheese string? Oh, right? yeah. Oh, blue eyes on it. Does as well. This yeah. is my next outfit. <laughs> it's actually a size 12. It's the smallest they had, but it's quite nice, I think. There you go. Um, quite cute, little frilly, little sleeves. Do you like it? I like it, it's yeah. It's not very me, normally. Like, not it's quite kind of um, plain for you. Yeah. But I probably wear it with like some bright shoes or something. So it's yeah. a bit more like. Speaking of bright shoes, these, how nice. They look like a bit, they don't actually obviously look like exactly, but 
like Valentina a little bit. They were like just fully nude and fully black, but I quite like the red. It's a bit different, isn't it? I think they're really nice. I think they're um, <coughs> be nice with red lipstick on and just these and then like a subtle outfit. That is cute. Look what it says, you'll love it. I thought it said Lucy me. I thought you did as well, it said hug wait, me. Wait, wait. How cute. I like it. I like the colour as well, I think it's quite a, um, a subtle pink, dusty pink. And this was how much? I think this was cheap, tell me. This was five pounds. Bargain. And then lastly this top, um, it kind of feels like a bikini top, but I think it's quite nice. And if I got, I need to get some shoes now that match this colour. Then we're in heaven. Summer, in Summer vibes. Yes, and this was only four pounds. You forgot these. Oh yeah. Underwear. Dun, Don't dun, really dun, need dun. to show that, do we? Really? Well. Try and haul. <laughs> we don't need views that desperately. <laughs> because 99% of the things I bought were very boring, I'm going to show you in about 10 seconds. So the first two things that I bought, this t-shirt, I got it, it might look massive, I got it in a 2XL because I kind of <laughs> like the loose, oversized kind of vibe. Yeah. It's quite thin, but it's going to be so good just for like chucking down like on a beach day or something when you just want to wear a plain white t-shirt. Are we going on holiday again then? Yeah, on of course we are. Day. Something that works, guys. Can't reveal it yet. And to pair with this, I got these denim shorts, which are stretch denim. Heaven. Oh, by the way, this t-shirt was two pounds. Really? Yeah, two pounds. Um, these shorts were mm, like eight pounds. I like yeah, these them. are like just distressed denim shorts, just white t-shirt, black t-shirt kind of goes. Chilled, comfy. Yeah. And the third thing I bought was these shoes. And I can't really walk in them yet because I've actually oh, taken off this. I hate that. Are they like espadrilles on the they're, side? Yeah, but they're just like tan kind of colour. Tan! No, you know what I mean, <laughs> no, you're like beige, basically. Beige. I only got one other thing, I'll show you it now. And this is the final thing I got, just a really casual summer shirt. The quality feels really nice, it feels almost silky. Nice. Um, this was, I think, how much was this? Nine pounds? Nine pounds. So bargain again, goes with the shorts, goes with the shoes, goes with the sunglasses. Summer's here, baby. <laughs> Thanks for watching today guys, hope you enjoyed coming to Brighton with us, seeing the new things we bought for summer. A bit of exciting news, we are growing much quicker at the moment than we ever have. Which means we've only just done our 4,000 subscriber giveaway, we're coming up to 5,000 subscribers, so of course we're going to do another giveaway guys. You guys know we like to say thank you for subscribing, thank you for watching the videos, thank you for sharing them, thank you for tweeting us, thank you for giving them a thumbs up. When we hit subscriber milestones, we like to say thank you, we like to give something back. So we're going to have a big push to 5k guys. If you think any of your friends would enjoy our channel, please share it, please let them know about the videos. We're starting to see some vlogs as well of our event from other people who were there who were filming, so that's so, so cool. Yeah, I know. Oh, you got it, okay. <laughs> you won, you oh, had me, he's gone. <laughs> Thanks again for watching guys, please give this video a thumbs up. And if you're new to the channel, please consider subscribing. As I say, we've got a 5K giveaway coming up very soon. Finishing off with a shout out today guys, Robert and Irene in the comments. Come to the channel recently through the cruise vlogs. Thanks so much for watching. If you want to shout out guys, as always, leave a comment below, let us know. And if you're one of our new subscribers, because we've had a lot recently, if you haven't introduced yourself in the comments yet, please do that as well, we'd love to chat to you. All right guys, we'll see you in the next video, bye.